Specialty groceries of meat, eggs, ice cream, cheese, and Wisconsin cheese, all in one shop in Makokoda, owned by family farmers Brandon and Heather Moore. It's called Moore Local. That's the name of their store. And here with me is Chloe Swanson. She's a, a longtime a Moore Local employee since the beginning of Moore Local. How many years ago? They opened yeah. almost five years ago, and I've been there about four and a half years. So <laughs> This place sounds so fun. We've been checking it out online and looking at the pictures. Is it fun to work there? It's the most fun job I've ever had in my life. <laughs> How many jobs have you had in your life, <laughs> young few, Chloe? Only but, a few. Uh, it's a great environment, family focused. Um, you get to talk to a lot of local and visiting people. So. Uh, and people love stores like this now. I mean, the kind of the general store, like a throwback to the way old days. But now this is, you know, here it is, 2022. Look at this good-looking family. So the, these are the Moors. So um, that's Heather and Brandon, and then their four children, yes. who are as cute as can be. And then you know, we also have a shot of the kids. There they <laughs> are. And so they grow. What, um, what do they do on the farm exactly? They have the a lot. Heather and the kids and Brandon raise uh, stock cattle and dairy cows, which Heather would love to be here today, but she is, sadly, it's time to milk on the farm. See? Um, so she's milking right now. Yes. Okay. Uh, they have goats, turkeys, chickens, ducks, cats, dogs. So the, the <laughs> eggs that you sell are yes. from their farm? Yes. Um, actually, Heather's two oldest sons, Tucker and Cassidy, the, the ones on the both ends, mm -hmm. Yep, they are yep. the masters of the chickens. They wash the eggs, they collect them, these they ki package them. Kids on the farm work hard, and these, these are, are you know modern kids who, who work hard on the farm. Oh, yeah. So that's a, that's a cool thing. So you have the eggs and, and the meat, right? Is yes. that how it started with yes. selling so the meat? so January 1st, Moores and their neighbors the Thompson family opened Rockdale Locker. So they have been processing uh, local meats on the farm, from the farm, uh, selling the fresh cuts in store, and it's just been booming from there. People love that, I mean, really. And then, I mean, look at your beautiful charcuterie tray. You guys <laughs> even do these fancy things. So tell me about the things you have on this tray. Yes, so um, right here, the most important part is the, the more cheese. Yes. So this is what this is right here. Um, so this is from um, from the cows, from the, yes. the the dairy on the farm. Yep. And let me try this. So this it's looks like a beautiful a beautiful cheddar, beautiful mild cheddar. Yes. Mm -hmm. So currently mm -hmm. it is being made mm -hmm. in Wisconsin in small art artisan batches, mm -hmm. um, but in about 30 days we're hoping to open our creamery mm. where Heather's uh, dairy milk will be brought to the store and made into cheese in store. That so. is so neat. This is wonderful. Oh my goodness. I mean, good cheese. How can you go wrong? You'll buy candies too. Yes, right? the most important part of a char charcuterie board is to have some additional flavors in here. Mm -hmm. So our mild cheddar, we have raspberry uh, pretzels. Mm -hmm. These are caramel nut clusters. Oh yeah. Your good hard salami, uh, Gruyere Swiss. Um, right here, these are Edgewood sticks. These so guys? these. They're jalapeno sticks with ghost pepper cheese. Oh my, is it really hot? They're a little spicy. I'm so <laughs> glad I knew that in uh, advance. <laughs> because you know, sometimes it's hard to talk when you got the peppers in your mouth, right? And then this is a white cranberry cheddar. It's amazing, oh especially on every charcuterie board. Okay. And then these are dark chocolate covered espresso beans. You did a nice job on that. Now, when we look at all these jars of things, the you do vendors from all over the Midwest. Yes, so we have kind of a system. So we first look to Jackson County. If we can find what we're looking for in Jackson County, we put it in store. Mm -hmm. um, if we can't hit Jackson County or Maquoketa, um, we tend to branch out to Iowa, and then from there to the Midwest. Got and it. then um, most of our products are sourced from the Midwest because we like to keep things local. So, and this is the outside, uh, how it looks yes. on the outside. Yes. This what, is what, what's your location in Maquoketa? So, Chloe? it's 605 Birch Drive. It's right off the industrial area of Maquoketa. Okay. Um, and we have a Bellevue store as well. Um, in the transition phase of moving to a little bit more space in Bellevue. Um, so, stay tuned, like, with our Facebook and Instagram to okay. see our location changes. But, yeah, we moved to this brand new building in, like, we got operational this past summer, so we've been in, in this building about a year. It looks like you have a lot of space. Yes, it's been very nice, because we started downtown Makokoda mm -hmm. uh, about five years ago, so we have grown 
exponentially. You, you, you outgrew grew that place. So we just saw the table and chairs there. Can you sit and yeah. eat? Yeah, we have booths. Um, we will be starting to sell grilled cheeses soon. That's our thing. We have homemade <gasps> bread, grilled cheese. Um, Edgewood ham. And uh, like baked goods like that, right? Yep, that's some of our ice cream. We mm -hmm. make ice cream cakes. We sell ice cream. Yes, the ice everything. cream. I saw that you have. Uh, who does your ice cream? So it comes from the chocolate shop in Madison, Wisconsin. Uh -huh. It is the creamiest, best ice cream I've ever had. Mm. Um, and you can't forget about our coffee. The coffees. It's yes. made from local milk from Wacon, Iowa. We use cream line milk because it, you know, makes everything taste better. I agree with that. And, and so your charcuterie boards, is this something I could order in advance or just you're just giving us examples of what we can do? Oh yeah, you can order charcuterie boards any time okay. of the year. Um, Heather mm -hmm. and her team will work with you on what size you want, about how many people you want to feed. and All the stuff in the coolers as well, all yeah. this great cheese. Uh, you guys are, uh, the Moors, they've got it going on, don't they? Yes, yep. Wow, and uh, local local honey yep. as well. From yep. Makokota, the candle comes from Makokota as See, well. Now here's the thing, one thing I was, <laughs> I thought I couldn't wait to drink this. So look at this, you guys. And then I look at it and it's what? Oh, it's a candle. It's a, it's a candle, and boy, does it ever smell good. Oh my goodness, it's so <laughs> special. Okay, we're talking about uh, more local. We're gonna put up the info. Chloe, you did a nice job. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Morris, <laughs> for, for sharing all of this with us. Uh, and Makoka, uh, they're on, on Birch Drive, and it's all local, 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 and we always love that. Thanks, Chloe.